do is only, you could come near the coil, but only scan on the white board. Don't go around to this side of the cables and the coil. Um, this, this is uh, Dr. Austin Richards, AKA Dr. Megavolt, and he's gonna get into a, a metal Faraday suit and um, uh, be in, inside this cage when, when the Tesla coil is going off. So what's going on here is we have a, a, a large outer cage. This is a, not an EMI area. This is just an outer cage that's open, but it's fully grounded. The floor is grounded, the walls are grounded. When the arcs come off, they, they seep ground. So they're going to the cage. And uh, Dr. Megavolt is, uh, will be wearing a, a metal suit that's also, um, that sometimes it'll be in contact with the grounded cage, but it won't matter. If he was actually floating above the ground, the lightning would go through the chute and out his, out his feet. Uh, I don't know if you want to uh, describe maybe the, the path of the electrical energy up into the Tesla plus. Give us a little uh, rundown of that. You've got a generator outside that you walk by that puts out 240 volts to the seat. It's like an industrial generator that gets stepped up to 15,000 volts by a transformer. And how many, watt, how many watts on the generator? 70,000 watts. So about half that power, about 35,000 watts, is transformed up to 15,000 volts. It comes through these white cables here and into the machine. And then the machine transforms it up to about a million volts. And that's what comes off the top. It, it's technically, it's 950,000 volts, but we're rounding up to a million, I hope. Okay, okay with that. So, um, so what we're going to do is we're going to give Dr. Megavolt a little time to get into his suit. This is uh, this is this is the victim. Well, hopefully, the victim survives. I'm I'm assuming it will. But this is a, a brand new IOSafe rugged portable device. This is the IOSafe rugged portable Thunderbolt. So. IOSafe style, we thought we'd do a little Thunderbolt testing, uh, which means different things at IOSafe, right? So we're going to do some Thunderbolt testing. This one has twin Intel SSDs, 500 series SSDs inside in a RAID 1. It's no bigger than our current rugged portable device. It's also, this is a prototype, but it's also uh, crush proof to 5,000 pounds, or 2,500 2,500 pounds for aluminum and 5,000 pounds for a titanium version. It comes in a, a RAID 1 or RAID 0. It also comes as a single mechanical drive, or it will come. This will be available in Q2. We still got to do a little bit more development on it, but it will be available in shipping in Q2. Uh, we'll also take a look at the Solo G3, which is a brand new IOSafe Solo product, fireproof, waterproof drive. We'll go ahead over there and take a look at that. But we're going to do the Cage of Death demo today and um, hopefully at, at the end of the demo you'll uh, appreciate how vulnerable your data might be and, and uh, you know watch this drive get zapped. Port technology and what, what I'll do here, this screen, this screen should light up. I didn't have my camera on this trip. Gears on! So Dr. Megavolt is wearing a, 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 a metallic mesh suit. It's fully conductive all the way through the suit. This is this is allowing the, the lightning energy, it will allow it to go around the outside of the suit. It's not going to shock him. The, the theory is, is that the electricity flows around the outside. It's called skin effect. And this is what keeps him safe.
That's so awesome. You guys getting some good pictures? All right. He's tall, he's tall, he just needs to be a little bit taller. He needs a lightning rod, I think. Or some bulbs. He's grabbing some uh, light bulbs, they're fluorescent bulbs. The gas will get energized from the lightning energy. Thousand degrees it's hotter than the surface of the sun by about two or three fold. See, so there's some dark spots on the ball. Yeah. The ball Is this good? Good for everybody? All right. <laughs> What's that? Maybe not for him. Oh, he's good. So the, the, this is a couple of pieces of wood with. With staples stapled in the wood, you'll see the arcs travel along that it's hot enough to get the wood on fire. sort of ISA style, right? So, um, do not do this with your normal electronics. It's not designed for it. But we just happen to be in a full metal outer shell, and um, with any luck, we're gonna recover from this. Shot? Everyone get it? Get it? Everyone got it? I don't want to zap it like 800 times while people are. I didn't get my shot. Shoot it again. Okay, one more. One more. One more cookie. Everyone get it? You're gonna make me zap it again? Yes. Everyone get it? Yeah. Get it? Okay. So we're gonna shut it down. I always hate this part. <laughs> we're good. We're good. You guys are brave. <laughs> <laughs> 
right so, fucking insane. No way. No way. <laughs> so, um, so we're gonna check this out and see if the the rugged rugged portable Thunderbolt uh, survived this. Got got hit pretty hard though. So let's go check it out. Earplugs out. Cage is open. And what we're gonna do? You're probably gonna want to film this part. Hold up a second. Earplugs. Earplugs. You can throw them away on this trash over here. So this. Oh, sorry. So this is the uh, the portable after, and we're gonna take the cap off. And somebody mess with my. Hold on. Somebody mess with my cord again. I'm gonna. Oh. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. So, so, um, you know what's funny at IO Safe is actually you like to back up your stuff, right? So, uh, <laughs> 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 you know, you know thunder, nice. thunderbolts are awesome, but the message is protect yourself before you wreck yourself, right? <laughs> if you felt scared, you're feeling data loss. It's what IOSafe does every day. Everyone calls us, oh my god, everything's horrible. My life is imploding on me, right? You, you got to feel it for a little bit. I, I should have just kept it going for at least a minute or two. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. But but it, it, I, I needed everyone here to feel, you know, what it's like to lose it. To just be at risk. IOSafe is about protecting people's data just like this. Stuff like this happens, you know, you drop it in a puddle. Doesn't mean you have to lose everything. Is we're gonna take our Thunderbolt drive. That was nice. Um, I really thought it, it was in the bottom. If this, if this drive, if this drive doesn't come back right away, uh, please don't consider it a, a failure of our equipment or our, our test or what have you, because it isn't natural to get hit by lightning bolts. That's not the point, right? Please don't write up something that talks about how oh, it didn't survive the million bolts. Okay. So let's plug it in. And I'm crossing my fingers here. <coughs> uh, was everyone, did, does anyone need a change of underwear after the last? <laughs> no, we're good? good? Okay, we can go. <laughs> so you've got the blue light on. The screen's starting to adjust so the, at least the display port transfer is working. So that's a, that's a good sign. I'm gonna switch to Finder. Open up a new window. Lucky us. IO safe SSD Thunderbolt. So I'll I'll just move this over to the screen, but so uh, it worked. So that was awesome, right? <laughs> so thanks for coming to our demo.